Oh, no. First of all, we want to call a lolly, you how up. Oh, shame, you're shy, but shame, you're back, brother. The burner to the fossils of the image where they stood. Tell them to the brothers out there, the highways and byways, pushing this bird in sincerity, right? Um, to the helps, to the sisters, right? Show the um, um, This evening, we want to start with um, Ephesians 6 and 13, as we beg the brother whole. Because this is at the time where we have to push. We have to push that um, when you have Bashem Yahushai forward, when you have Bashem Yahushai come, him see we as acceptable servants, eh? right? Servants we um, did what was requi required. Um, Praise him. Ephesians 6, 13 and 10. He said, Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Put on the whole armor of Yahweh that he may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. Right. Read up back. Yeah, stop back. Yeah. Just read up. Ephesians 6 and 10 is a final in my brethren. He is strong in the Lord. Right. So we have, we have to be strong in Yahweh Shem Yahushai. We have to um, put Yahweh Shem Yahushai first. Right. We have to have faith and confidence that in the upcoming time he's going to protect us as he said he would right and in the power of his might right and in his might um as we did a reason i think last night we say yo we don't really know how the heavenly father is going to directly feed us but we see examples that the heavenly father use it right um in the book of exodus um exodus here when we're coming out of egypt we get feed with manna from the heavenly father right countless amount of profit right as the brother said elijah get fed by a raven countless amount of profit get delivered um through tribulations by the heavenly father eh? right so we have to use our profit as examples right and um build your faith through them and um through the things that we see coming on the earth eh? Verse 11, he said, put on the whole armory of Yahweh that he may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. Yeah. We, have to, we have to do that um, now. Yeah. Now is an acceptable time as the scripture said. Because Isa is coming hard yeah. here. Isa is coming as a, as a roaring lion. You know, he made the power. Him, him uh, pushing hard now is um, Max scenes yeah. Right? And, and as the brother say, yo, that's a part of Esau's agenda, right? Um, we, we know that here yeah, there is Maxine bad for you, but that's just a slight um, taking the job. It's just a, um, a picking up of the iceberg, as the brother say, yo. It's actually, we actually see where he used the um, Maxine's to push a greater agenda, yeah, right? If he used the um, Maxine as them say, never let a good crisis go to waste. We use the vaccine to implement um, the CDBC, right? Central Development Banking um, Currency, right? We use the um, the the vaccine, right? To um, central bank, or uh, central bank digital currency. Um, Mark twenty four verse forty two. Says, watch therefore, for you know not what all your Lord will come to. You know this, that if the woodman of the house had known in what watch the thief would come, he would have watched and would not have suffered his house to be broken up. Right? Therefore be also ready, for in such an hour as ye think not, the Son of Man cometh. And, and, and we, we in the time, in the perfect time, so we know, say, oh, the good man says near. Right? We, we see signs. We get signs from the heavenly father written in the scriptures um when when the time is nigh as the scriptures say yo, um perilous times shall come upon the earth and those things eh? that go to that um verse 3 say much 24 say and as he sat upon the mount of olives the disciples came on in privately saying tell us when shall these things be right. and what shall be the sign <laughs> of thy coming and of the end of the world and Yahweh shall answer and said unto them, Take heed that no man deceive you, for many shall come in my name, saying, I am the anointed, and shall deceive many. 
right? And you shall hear of wars and rumors of wars. And we're hearing about that now, right? Um, America is at it with Russia and China, right? They have trade war. They have. Um, I see that you've been in trouble. For all these things must come to pass, but the end is not yet. For nation shall rise against nation, kingdom against kingdom, and there shall be famines and pestilences and earthquakes in diverse and, places. Right? Um, nation against nation, that's a third world war, right? You say, yo, famine. Um, early on in the year, um, when I remember the first, the first thing, but they must say, yo, prepare for famine of biblical proportioning, right? You think that's a joke, right? Um, recently, them say, yo, five more percent, five more percent of an, um, the chicken, yeah. Oh, right? oh, see, see, chicken. Yeah. They say five percent go on that day, yeah. and it now, it now get no better, yo. Yeah, you have, you have disruption to the global supply chain Can. all around the world. You know, um, with major producers like you know, uh, Brazil, China, and, uh, and these other countries that experience um, drought, if on a drought, or some other kind of. Um, Infestation or some uh, oh, yeah. kind of locust or something like that. In India, kind, isn't it? India, isn't it? So all of the major producers are, are experienced, isn't it? Different things where we're, we're causing them to not output as much as they can. Yeah. Isn't it? And they, they, they do WHO and other world health, um, a world organization. I explain that we're we are going to a hunger crisis. Right? Exactly. And if things are cheap, then what is the millions of people are going to Yeah, look, you have to have, as you talk about the major supplies, you have um, catastrophes that happen here differently. Like, gun, gun. like forest a whole heap of flooded forest fire and all them, the flooding and all them things there. We destroy crop and all them things there. Too. So, the, the agenda get pulled from all different angles. Yeah? Um, even, even, you know, this, not, not to say the starting, but like, you know, the middle time with this um, big sea, right? You have um, farmers where basically drop them beans them beef um, production yeah. We have farmers we, we, we um say yo this now profit them in a them time they them stocks that the and 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 um I remember an article I read where the um person who produced the beef him say take a good while before them start to them profit there yeah, when um, you get you get the cow, you raise the cow to a certain and then from there you continue on it, right? If that stuff, you know, make no sense, eh? these people actually lose them hope. So them say yo F off with um beef production and certain other companies. Eh? Mm -hmm. I have farmers who I get paid for destroy them crop also. Can can yeah? I jump in down to verse 32. It says now learn a parable of the fig tree. When his branch is yet tender and put it for leaves, yeah. he know that summer is nigh. Right. So likewise ye, when ye sh shall see these things, know that it is near even at the door. Yeah, when, when we see, when we see as we just mentioned, the farmers them stop production, um, the crisis them will affect these farms as well. Right? We know say near yeah, a farming of biblical proportion is near. Right? When you see how um countries are flex them most against each other right you know so your war is near um them them have in, in ancient time them usually use um war arms or war sounds eh, with them blow a trumpet and you know say your time for war right that's what we in right now yeah the trumpet being blown for war and, right. and the scripture actually tells us make a joyful noise unto the lord and, and basically, the, the prophets and the highways and byways out here, hey, we are making the joyful noise, man. Right. And, and, and the nations, them, the nations, them, we can see as I talk about the, the destruction of the water going on, the joyful noise we're making in the Middle East and right across other parts of the world because actually the world they are going to a war cry. So we, that we see now we're not, we're not in a time of war. Okay? Even, the fact, even the fact that you see, um out here as the prophet of David the father, you know, that's supposed to be a sign 
of the times as well, yeah? You can. Right? He's saying he's going to raise, Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai, going to raise up a prophet in the last days, yeah? Alright, uh, jumping down to verse 45, verse 24 and 45. He says, Who then is a faithful and wise servant, yeah. whom his Lord hath made ruler over his household to keep them meek in the season? Blessed is that servant. Blessed is that servant whom his Lord, when he cometh, shall find so doing. Yeah, that's why we have to, we have to labor in this truth. We have to um, build brothers, we have to um, do breakdowns um, constantly. Right? We have to pray and fast. Right? We, have to, we have to keep ourselves um, active and in a watchful state of mind. Yeah? Right? Because as the brother read the scripture earlier, we know not the um, time. The time when the master coming, hey, we don't, we just get time. Like, like a master say, yo, um, by wind, by wind, we have come back. He never say, yo, he might, he might come back the 13th of the start of winter. He just say, yo, in the winter season, he might come back. So you have to um, watch, you have to keep the master's house. Right. He say, um, barely I say unto you, that he shall make him ruler over all his goods. Right. But and if that evil servant shall say in his heart, My Lord delayed his coming, and shall begin to smite his fellow servants and to eat and drink with the drunken, yeah. the Lord of that servant shall come in a day when he looketh not for him, and in an hour that he is not aware of, and shall cut him asunder, and appoint him his portion with the hypocrites, and they shall be weeping and gnashing of teeth. And because they even the father give you um uh, we don't want to say guidelines, but the Heavenly Father actually tell you, say, yo, if you if you now come to push his word um, to the end, better you don't start it. You say, yo, um, sir, the servant, I get me with many strife and it come up and not to do the will of the Father. Yeah. That's so, it. so, yo, if you're in this truth, you find yourself in this truth, what else you can do, yo? There's nothing to turn back to. He's a... Uh, <laughs> Isa uh, will have it on, on that side if you turn back to it. And Yao Bashim Yosh. No, Yao Bashim Yo. Isa and Yao Bashim go have your head. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Anyway, you turn, yo. So turn to the Heavenly Father. Turn yeah. to Yao Bashim Yosh, yeah. which will protect you when Isa yeah. uh, come in as a flood, yo. Right? Yeah. 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 you're going to get this try in more ways than one, yeah. That's, that's, that's why I posed the question to Peter and him said to him, say, Love us me no more than this. Yeah, that's why I said, feed, feed him sheep or feed him, feed him, um, feed him flocks, man. Feed him flocks. Then? There, there's nothing else. This, this is what we've been speaking about here. Yeah? Right? These are the times where we, we yeah. were joyful in the start. Right? And now we're supposed to be more joyful here. Yeah? Right? Because it. As the scripture say, yo, your salvation nearer than you believe, yo. Right? But then, the least the good thing we see, we say, yo, tomorrow. <laughs> yo, you, you on fire, yeah. Right? No, we have to keep the fire blazing, yo. We have to keep that fire blazing. I never, 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 the apostles them, you know, right. they are used to the coming of the, of the Lord. That's why they are asking the question, you know, when, when they are going to restore the kingdom man to um, yeah. Israel. Because and basically, they would have begged for the kingdom restored right. from the end time, you know. Yeah, Oshai. Yeah, Oshai yeah. yeah. say, yo, what would I be darling? Yo, yeah, Oshai won't come back and burn this place, yo. <laughs> this ain't no joke. Yo, yeah, Oshai won't come burn up this place, this wicked ass society. Right, and if, if you can't see say, this society wicked as well, you need to get burned as well, yo. There's nothing left in this society, right? Turn to your, your woman who's supposed to give you the biggest amount of comfort, right? You get burned, yo. Right? You, you have to turn to one word, they might decide to, yo, they might make it mandatory if you get, you get, the, get, the, man, the, yeah, you get, the get mandatory if you get this job, yo. So where you have to turn to, yo? Turn to the Father, you poor, you. Uh, Second Angel 16, verse 40. O oh, my people, hear my word and make you ready to the battle. All right. And in those evils, even as pilgrims upon the earth, right. he that selleth 
let him be as he that flee away, he that buy it, as he that want, as one that will lose. Um, you can look up to, no, I know Mira mentioned it, but you can look up to pilgrimage, right? Um, look up pilgrimage, and um, pilgrims aren't people who believe if it does walk all day, walk all night. You know, them actually have a faith, them actually have a hope for them walk towards it, right? So, as the scripture says, you'll be as pilgrim in those times, eh? you know, you have to walk in faith. You have to be like um, the book of Eli. You read my mind, brother. You have to be, be like that as, as Eli in the book of Eli, eh? right? Walk not by sight, but by faith. Yo. Run, run. And it's a pilgrimage. It's a, um, a journey of a pilgrim. One. Especially one to a shrine or sacred place. Wait, it actually tell you say you actually um go to a higher party. They basically walk towards a higher party. Well we know that we are doing it. Say um either occupied merchandise as he that had no profit by it, and he that build it as he that shall not dwell therein. Right. He that sow it as if he should not reap, so also he that plants in the vineyard as he that shall not gather the grape. Dance. And more and more, we have to embrace the priest up here and be touched because more and more, you, you see, more and more, you see laws being passed to force you Dance. to come right. fly and take you know, the devil's juice. Dance. 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 Uh, the parliament known in Jamaica more and more openly. And the more people are going to be abundant, more private sector companies are mandated. Isn't it? So the squeeze is coming. In the United States, isn't it? We've been seeing news recently. Our federal employees are getting every company that have uh, over 100, 100, 100 workers, staff, yeah? isn't it? After that mandated, isn't it? And that's going to affect 100 million Americans, isn't it? No, no, no. And that's just the beginning, yo. Yes, I mean, that's just the beginning. Now the Homeland Security is saying that if you're against COVID measures, yes, I mean, then you can be seen as a um, as a as a as a as a, as a terrorist. Yes, I mean, a potential terrorist. Then, if you're against the world, yes, I mean, so no other time for you be prepared to lose. Yes, I mean, they're, they're like, um, that's what I'm always saying. We're gonna, we're gonna lose. I have to prepare for lose everything, yo. Isn't it? Because I'll come down to the wire. Realistically, we have to choose between getting tossed up or losing your job. All not right. being able to take care of your family and all these things. And that's where faith will come in, yo. The brother talked yeah. recently um, at the beginning about the devil the father feeding his prophet. We're gonna have to trust that, Elijah is a perfect example of that. The Lord feed Elijah with ravens as he said, and him lead him from city to city, is it? Different places to get food, right? We will lead him to a woman one at a time, and the woman of our last uh, 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 meal, right? And him, him said to the woman, feed me first, and you got food until the end of the famine, is it? And 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 it was so. So we don't know what we as the Father are going to feed me at the time to come, and I'm going to protect me at the time to come, but. We reach that point now where we have to let go. Yeah, isn't it? Now we can maneuver little by little. Isn't it? We can we can squeeze away around certain um, inconveniences and still get with the day to day um, substance. By the time I come, we have to make that stand. When the black and white line are going to draw, and you have to go to the store and say, Yo, either you're for your heart, or you're for this world. Yeah, right. Isn't it? Yeah. And a lot of people feel are going to waver in that day yo, when they actually see. That your life will get impacted by this. Uh, a lot of brothers in this for years. I knew brothers coming in and them don't, them don't see it as something. But really and truly, I gotta affect them in you know, our personal way. And it will. Yes, and I if you don't have that faith, eh, you have to crumble. You don't know, have that big faith. You have to crumble. Big faith. That's why, as the brother mentioned before, he said, you, know, you have to detach from knowing. Right? So when you when you come when it comes down to those times you'll be like, oh well, you must have got people one at them time. Right? You know I mean? Simple as that, you have to detach, you have you have to you have to think about that it's not making money to put in heaven the father giving you um 
sufficient as the scriptures are sufficient till the day is even the rough day. Right? The Heavenly Father has given you sufficient to carry day by day. Right? And believe, believe in that way, yo. you're going to believe that the Heavenly Father will feed you when, when the time gets harder than this. Eh? Right. This is um, Hebrews 11 verse 1 now. Faith is the substance of things hoped for. Right? I don't <laughs> The evidence of things not seen. Right? We jump down to verse um, verse 6. It's about without faith. It's, it, it is impossible to please him. For he that cometh to Yahweh must believe that he is and that he is a reward of them that diligently seek him. Yeah. And without faith, you're going to take this um, job here. And ultimately, you're going to take this um, RFID chip. Right. And you're going to be destroyed by Yahweh Bashem Yahushai because you're a faithless servant. Right. Christianity go realize they never believe in the most times. It's like, it's like, them overall, them way automatically do evil. Yeah, right? and so Lot, back to the God, and um, Lot's wife as well. Exactly, it's so because they're all about the physical thing, right. I mean, that's them. Right. Um, they go reach to the point where you yourself are going to say no way out. You are going to try to think about the problem and come up with a solution. And you are going to come up empty hand to eat. You see me? You are going to be back into a corner and the only way out is you have to watch them you are You see me? And, and in that moment, that's when you have to exercise feet. Because what we have now, we don't really have to exercise feet right now because we're comfortable, yeah. really and truly. Yeah, we're not still we comfort now. Yeah. We can still and get what we need. We have some sort of income. Right. It's a bit to take care of our needs and for our family to take care of our family. Mm -hmm. So really and truly, the fear and the need to get uh, um, exercise yeah. But it has come to the point where those around you are going to turn against you. It's if we get a call from the landlord that and call me to take a call from the father and the father and the father and the father. I ain't you know what you say at the end of the call, go and get the job. Yeah. Right? Don't be afraid of it. Right? Because I did it and I'm fine. And the reason why I said that is because our appearance of the age and our appearance have gotten it. I believe pretty much not the same yard as our parents. Yeah. So in our mind, is it it's gonna reach to the point where they must say they must say me is a threat. Yeah. yeah. Hell. Because me don't want to take it. Is it me? And all them things there, isn't it? So it's gonna reach to the point where I can understand really and truly that. People that are not a part of the truth are your enemies. Yeah. You're yeah. against the people, your family, your friends, your co workers, even your woman. You see me? You have to realize that if you're not the brother of them, you're alone. You see me? You have to present This is Micah 2, verse 10. Arise ye and depart, but this is not your rest. Because it is polluted, it shall destroy you. Even with a sewer destruction. Yes, I have to remember, this is not the goal, yo. Right. right? As, uh, as, as the angel said to, um, to Ezra, I can get that, I think, a second Ezra, some four and. and four. Wait, let me say, um, let me see if I can find it. Let me say, um, this is day four of day three for the week. What about scripture? I mean, the. Yeah, what? Well, well. Matter 12, and verse 30 said. He that is not with me is against me. And he that gathereth not with, with me scattereth abroad. And he asked him to leave that. Well, you know, the two thirds actually, I should say, the one who's taking the job actually saying that right now, so I the one that don't. Yeah. You know? Yeah. So the two side of the class, they want that we'll see them after that. Yeah. That's why I agree, though. The second is just chapter 7. And verse 42, he says, He answered me and said, This present life is not the end where much glory is not abide. I said, This is not the goal, yo. He said, Therefore have they prayed for the weak, but the day of doom shall be the end of this time and the beginning of immortality for to come, wherein corruption is past, intemperance is at an end, infidelity is cut off, righteousness is grown, and truth is sprung up. Oh, oh, this life is supposed to be glorious, eh? right? Look around you, right? Not even the richest man of um, our, our lineage, 
you can say you him in um, a joyful state because we ended up with the forget there. Right? This is not this is not your rest here. This is not um, where glory is rising. Right? Um, the earth have to be um, as it means to say you have to, to bind first the strong man or the host before you can rule you. Right? So Esau have to come out of power before we can get that rest that we so desire. Yep. Um, second Ezra 8 verse 1 and he answered me and said the most I have made this work for many right. for the world to come for few That's how we target the different man. Yeah. That's, that's why our target. That's why our target got to be to the effort of Father, yo, for deliverance. So, so, so I'm pretty sure you tell us that they're my target to them. Come let us cut them off from being a nation. Yeah. So them so them have, them have to do it on a, a some 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 conspiracy. We bring it to make it look like a whole a whole people are the are the main are the main one behind the, the spreading of it, yeah? It's a second verse 8 and verse 50 say, For many great miseries shall be done to them that in the latter time shall dwell in the world because they have walked in great pride. But understand thou for thyself and seek out the glory for such as, such as be like thee. So, so we have to, as the brother mentioned, um, this truth, um, not this truth, but our circle got to be within the brotherhood, you know, right? Those are men who actually see both um, salvation like like yourself, you know, yeah. right? So we have, we have, to, we have, to, we have, we have to um, build each other, right? We have to um, push forward, you know, right? We have to see both the kingdom. You know, Stand fast in the truth. Alright, Hebrews 11. Okay, finish, brother. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hebrews 11, verse 13. He said, These all died in faith, that yeah. having received the promises, but having seen them afar off, yeah. and were persuaded of them, and embraced them, and confessed that they were strangers and pilgrims on the earth. For they that say such things declare plainly that they seek a country. And truly, if they have been mindful of that country, from whence they came out, they might have had opportunity to have returned. But now they desire a better country, that is a heaven. Wherefore, Yahweh is not ashamed to call their God, but he has feared for them to sit. Right, so it, it's no more the America dream supposed to be on your forehead because America is down right now, yeah? Right? right. So we're looking, we're looking for that city, the heavenly father, say he's going to build for us, yeah? going to build by us, well not by our hand, but um, the other nation, like, but we are going to be ruled of the city, then, right? It's time to get up off the ground and go, as, go on earth as princes, then, right? That's, that, that's what we are building towards, right? Not to stay as servant in Esau's kingdom. Right. This is Isaiah uh, 60 verse 1. It says, Arise, shine, for thy light is come. And the glory of the Lord is risen upon thee. For behold, the darkness shall cover the earth and grow the darkness of the people. Yep. But the Lord shall arise upon thee, and his glory shall be seen upon thee. Thank and Gentiles shall come to thy light, and the kings to, thy bright, to the brightness of thy rising. Lift up thine eyes round about and see how they gather themselves together. They come to thee, thy sons come from afar, and thy daughters shall be nursed at thy sight. Then shall thou see and flow together. And thine heart shall fear and be enlarged, because the abundance of the sea shall be converted unto thee. The forces of the Gentiles shall come unto thee, 
the multitude of camels shall cover thee, the dromedaries of Midian and Ephah, all they from Sheba shall come, they shall bring gold and incense, and they shall shew forth the praises of the Lord. Right. All the flocks of Kedar shall gather together unto thee, and the rams of Nebo shall minister unto thee. They shall come up with acceptance on mine altar, and I will glorify the house of my glory. Who are these that fly as a cloud, as the doves to their widows? Windows? Surely the isles shall wait for me, and the ships of Tarshish first, to bring thy sons from far, thy sil their silver and their gold with them, unto the name of the Lord thy God, and to the Holy One of Israel, because he has glorified thee, and the sons of strangers shall build up thy walls, and their kings shall minister unto thee, for in my wrath I smote thee, right. but in favor of I have mercy on thee. That's a very good start. Amen. Oh, yeah, 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 As the brother I just mentioned to you in the name of the Father's wrath, he punishes him, but now he's in the time of um, returning back to his, the heavenly Father, yeah, right? Where we've been right with our power again, you know, right? And after this, we ain't going to think go back in slavery no more yeah. we ain't going to think we go from the heavenly father right because we're going to learn our lesson and the heavenly father is going to replace the heart of the stone right which is that sinful um lustful um hard yeah. mindset as the brother say um and give us a, a righteous mindset yeah, right where we go on we go understand that all these laws and statutes were made to make us perfect, right? And we're going to do them perfectly, as the scripture has mentioned as well. This is Hebrews 8, and I'll read from verse um, verse 8. For finding power with them, he said, The old days come, saith the Lord, that I will make a new covenant with the house of Israel and with the house of Judah. Not according to the covenant that I made with their fathers in the day when I took them by the hand to lead them out of the land of Egypt, because they continued not in my covenant. I regarded and not say the Lord. For this is the covenant that I will make with the house of Israel after those days, saith the Lord. I will put my laws in their mind and right. write them in their hearts, and I will be to them a God, and they shall be to me a people. And they shall not teach every man his neighbor and every man his brother, saying, Know the Lord, for all shall know me, from the least to the greatest. For I will be merciful to their unrighteousness and their sins and their iniquities will I remember no more. Yeah, because we, we grew up from that young stage, right? We've been growing from that young, um, foolish stage where, we, where our father, Yahweh Shem Yahushai, right, said to us, say, oh, don't do this, don't do that, right? We grow this way, this way you're supposed to grow. We are, we are a perfect manual, right? We learn and understand now that yeah, a time to grow now and stop our bullshit, yo. Right? It's time to turn to the heaven of the Father as the Holy and we're going to learn it even more when this day is approaching. So, yo, there is no other way but the heaven of the Father's eh? Right? There's no other way but the heaven of the Father's hand. We're going to learn that, yeah. Ezekiel 36, verse 24 For I will take you from among the heathen and gather you out of all countries yeah. and bring you into your own land. Then will I sprinkle clean water upon you and ye shall be clean from all your filthiness and from all your idols will I cleanse you. A new heart will I put within, will I give you and a new spirit will I put within you and I will take away the stony heart out of your flesh and I will give you an heart of flesh and I will put my spirit within you and cause yeah. you to walk in my statutes. And he shall keep my judgments and do them. The Goel brother, I read this and we just have meditated and been clean, you know. Or, or, or refreshing that feeling, right? We just be clean for one thing, right? We just, you know. Not wrestle with the flesh anymore. And you shall dwell in the land that I gave to your fathers, and you shall be my people, and I will be your God. I also will save you from all your uncleanness. I will cause the corn and will increase it and lay no famine upon you. 
and I will multiply the fruit of the tree, the increase of the fields, and he shall receive no more reproach of famine among the heathen. Oh, oh, it be we have your own land. Land. We, we, we don't have we don't have the LA to make up land in this society. But let me have lands eh? I got right? more than your heart can, can desire. Right. Any meal where you, where you desire, I'm going to be brought to you. Sir, no matter what. places where you've never been to on the road, yo. You're not going to hear that. You're not going to hear that. No, it's, it's going to be driest in the kingdom and that will look what? You're talking right. talk about Pony Hurt? You're talking about Pony Hurt? Like, like me watching um, the series, um, um, the, the, the 100. Season 7. And basically them have um, a machine we can take them from planet to planet and just check them travel. <laughs> they are travel in a second, them look as a boom. I travel from planet to planet in the machine. I think what them set up, yeah. What? yeah, yeah. Basically them thing there. He's them, our dream boy where we are. Yeah, yeah. He's our dream boy. We are gonna do man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yo, yeah. We're tired of 9 to 5 now, yeah. right? How much, how much have we can say you without master giving you a small vacation leave? Right? How much have you can say you alright? I'm going to get up tomorrow and I'm going to just travel the world. I'm going to get money to travel the world. You're going to get money to travel You have to apply for your passport. Yeah. Oh, okay. so, can even apply for your visa without taking the surface. Can can no as the brother mentioned a good point. No, you can't apply for certain privilege, right? If you don't take it the to job yo. Yeah. That that's so we, we get we are getting choked in um slavery, right? It's it's unbearable now, yeah. Yeah, it's a wicked list. Alright, this is um I just said the world was born for since the beginning of the world. Men have not heard nor perceived by the ear, neither have the eye seen, O oh God, beside thee, what he has prepared for them that waited for him. Gold, precious stones, right? Lands, holes, wives, right? Um, harder in your house, right? Because, yeah, you can't believe all the you can, you can try to have a whole heap of women in this society even though they are tainted and thing yeah. but what the cost you right when your woman nagging in here you say oh you pay up for that woman that's not going to happen you sometimes I just want to have some some whole heap of goat you when I get the money from the start of the you just want to have a, you just want to have a farm, you know, farm, gala out and you just eat um, fresh vegetables yeah. or fresh food or fight and eat the same time, you know, right? Don't begin orange or fly orange juice. Because they don't want to eat the farm. You know, you know, you know uh, the precept in um, uh, Syrup 25 and I think 7, when you said it, uh, basically, yeah. The things are more in desire, like a man will live to see the joy of children and, and he that lives to see the fall of his enemy. Man. See? Yeah. And them things that, them thing that make, make me happy. Yeah? Yeah. The enemy have been in this mindset, the enemy have been in this mindset. Right? The enemy is the one who has been in this mindset. The enemy is the one who has to Jamaica unless you get a passport and yeah. them seed fit to make you left this country right that's the enemy for you and i heard a great voice out of heaven saying behold the tabernacle of god is with men right and he will dwell with them and they shall be his people right. and god himself shall be with them and be their god right. and god shall wipe away all tears from their eyes and there shall be no more death neither sorrow nor crying neither shall there be any more pain for the former things are passed away. And he that sat upon the throne said, Behold, I make all things new. As, and, he, and he said unto me, Right, for these words are faithful and true. Yo, even to serve the Father in righteousness, right? Even if we have a Sabbath, 
how much we can say we have, we truly have a Sabbath, a complete rest here. Right? Uh, we just basically think up on the name of the Father when we think of the name of the Father and that name. But, you know, we just say oh, we don't have nothing today because today is the Sabbath. Eh? How much we can say that? Yeah, how much are we have to go to work? How much are we work 9 to 5? We can't do that. Right? Yeah, man, I'll bring out this picture. Isaiah 51 verse 14, he said the captive exile is dead that he may be loose, yeah. and that he should not die in the pit, and nor that his bread should fail. And we, we don't want to live in this forever. Yeah. I, it's stressing if you just get up a man in time and say, yo, and this way I look to watch, right? It is the full of 9 to 5 works, right? Only making enough money to make your boss wealthy. Right? And you scrape bike. No matter how long you work it. Right? We're tired of going out of one place and look if I'm working at this item. Right? We're tired of drink um eat some pies where them call water yeah. Yeah, that's a point you can be a boy and a boy can be a girl and be like Yeah, this is That's a utter confusion, brother Right? Hey, with it, with it, with it We have to some same for some reason Hey, you have people, you have people, you have people up there glorifying America, man They are glorifying America Zin, I'm basically, America is a shit house, a shit hole Because, just in the, just in the, um Time I passed to America the other day. She was she say, if New York would go crazy about, yeah. I want shit to all. Yeah. That, that, that um, girl with the hand with the young people, yeah. right? That now she gets old and all she can, all they can see, can, can, all they can see when our mind right? We can literally see how America is falling. Yeah. I will wait for the burnt of America. That's, that's all we're waiting for right now. Right. So, as the brother mentioned before, um, we see the fall of your enemies. Eh? Yeah. Right? These are you don't got to go. Right? But not before him serve the punishment. Alice I borrowed four of verse um, 36 says, Oh Jerusalem, look about thee towards the east, and behold, the joy that cometh unto thee from God the house. Lo, thy sons come, whom thou sentest away. They come gathered together from the east to the, to the west by the word of the Holy One, rejoicing in the glory of Yahweh. Yeah. Right. And we see brothers waking up constantly, right? Where you think we're waking up and do you? You think we're waking up and say, oh, we want to go back to We're waking up and chanting down in the kingdom, right? Um, find, um, find the honor, or share, share the honor, as the scripture say, right? We, we wish um, this kingdom fall tomorrow, you know? oh. but... No, I wish we go my ears say no, America, no. America get bombed. No, no, I right. attack Israel, no, I attack Iran, I attack... No, no. I attack... Yeah. 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 That's all we have here. It's like Ecclesiastes 25 and verse 7 says, There be nine things which I have judged in my heart to be happy, Them and the ten I will utter with my tongue. A man that a joy of his children, children and he that liveth to see the fall of, of his enemies. Right. Which is right. So, 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 and we're coming to the time of Esau's birth year. Right? So we have to wrap up now. So you want to say, Shalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalalal